What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you're new here, I welcome you. I hope you enjoy this channel. I post a lot about fitness, nutrition, workout tips, uh, healthy recipes, what I eat in a day. My purpose of this channel is to just somehow positively impact your life and help you get on a healthier, happier track for your own life. So I hope you can learn something from my channel. Thanks for stopping by again. This video is going to be about why it seems that fitness resolutions always seem to fail. Everybody usually makes a fitness New Year's resolution and then come March, the re resolution isn't around anymore. They've dropped it, they've moved back to their own life, you know, old lifestyles and the cycle repeats the next year. Why is that? We're gonna break that down right now. This is a video inspired by my Healthy New You program that I wrote with Oxygen Magazine, which launches on New Year's this year. Um, I designed this program to be a program that will help you change your lifestyle to last. This is the, the underlying theme of this program and this is how I designed it. So uh, the program is very gradual and uh, progressive as you go. And uh, more about that at the end of this video because I wanna get to this topic first. Why do fitness resolutions seem to always fail? In my experience as a trainer, as a coach, as someone who does fitness year round, someone who coaches people usually around New Year's resolution time, I've seen and I've witnessed people, they bite more off than they can chew. And what I mean by that is their lifestyle is maybe they, for example, they don't go to the gym, they eat out a lot, they drink alcohol a lot, they're overall unhealthy, they don't feel good, they're unhappy with their body, so they think, okay, come January 1st, I'm gonna be working out every single day, I'm not gonna eat out, I'm not gonna drink, I'm not gonna do anything, I'm gonna get healthy. Well, that passion and that desire is great, but that commitment is way too big for their lifestyle to really last. That change is so immense that it's not gonna stick to their lifestyle that they're used to. So a way that we can slowly adapt the healthier lifestyle is by breaking it down into smaller pieces and giving yourself a longer amount of time to accomplish those things and have it be a slow, steady, gradual change instead of just January 1st, my lifestyle is gonna turn 360 degrees, I'm gonna be a totally different person. That's unrealistic and that's why it seems to fail because people commit to way too much and then they don't know how to maintain it in their daily lifestyle, so they just give up. So my advice to you, if you are trying a fitness resolution this year, I want you to succeed. So I want you to break it down into small gradual changes. So here's a very easy basic guideline on how you can do this because it might seem overwhelming at first. You're gonna be like, I don't know where to start then. You know, so here you go. Number one step, assess your lifestyle. Assess the things that you know are not healthy and that you eventually want to change. So for example, say you don't you don't exercise. You haven't exercised in a few months, you don't do it, and you want to do it, but you just don't. So you don't exercise, say you drink four times a week alcohol. And say you eat out probably five times a week. You don't eat healthy, you know you don't get enough protein, you don't exercise, you don't you drink alcohol. The four things that you've assessed of your lifestyle that you know that are unhealthy, that you know you wanna change. Now that you have those four things assessed and written down, number two step is to write out a plan for you to change those things slowly and gradually over time. So for example, say you don't exercise, instead of committing to exercising every day because Realistically, you're not gonna do it. You don't do it every day. That's too big of a change. So commit to this. Exercise one day a week. You're gonna think, that's so easy, I could do that. Okay, great, do it. Do it one day a week for two weeks. Then the next two weeks, do it two days a week. And then the next two weeks, do it three days a week. And then the next two weeks, try four days a week and see how that goes. So take your calendars and plan it out. This week to this week, I'm gonna work out once a week this week to this week, I'm gonna work out twice a week. And just give yourself a slow and gradual plan to follow. That will be more realistic for you because you're gonna learn how to adjust and, and shift your schedule and adopt that healthy lifestyle in a way that will make it stick. If you just change overnight, you know, cold turkey, it's not gonna work. So that's your exercise plan. Say you drink, like I said, you drink alcohol four times a week. First few weeks, try drinking only three times a week. And then the next two weeks, try drinking only twice a week. And maybe twice a week is what you want to stick at, so you're done there. 
And then say you drink sodas. Maybe switch, try switching to uh, zero calorie sodas instead. See if you can do that. Or maybe you drink zero calorie sodas twice a week and the rest are a regular soda. And then you slowly, slowly transfer over to the zero calorie sodas. And then you slowly transfer over maybe to like those zero calorie juices that aren't the sodas. And then you transfer over to teas, you know, um, and maybe, maybe you like drinking the zero calorie sodas and you know that's a healthier option for you and you learn to love them just as much as regular sodas over time. Um, and then what was my other thing? Oh, eating out. Say you eat out five times a week, try eating out four times a week. So you guys know what I mean. Like, it's a slow and steady gradual changes for each thing that you wanna change in your life. Give yourself time. Time is your friend. You don't have to do it overnight cold turkey. That's not gonna work. Another thing you can do is equip yourself with the right tools. So what I mean by that is say you're, you know, you did your exercise plan, you're gonna work out once a week for two weeks. Well, don't wander in the gym not knowing what to do. Come in with a plan. Come in with your your workouts written out for you. So all you have to do is follow them. Look up the exercises before you get to the gym so you know exactly what you're doing. Prepare yourself for success. Prepare yourself for success. Give yourself the tools that you need to succeed. Everything is there for you. It's just a matter of you taking those things and applying them. All right, here's my next tidbit of information and this is a huge one, you guys. Don't give up when you mess up because you will mess up lots of times. You will, maybe you write out your plan for six months perfectly, you follow my steps, you do everything that I say. Let me tell you something, you will mess up. You will fall off your plan. It's inevitable, everybody does it, you're only human. Don't give up when you mess up. Expect the mess ups, try to prevent them, but it, you're gonna do them, it's okay. Don't beat yourself up about it. All you have to do, put it behind you, don't think about it anymore, take it day by day, committing to your goals every single day. If you just focus on the day at hand and, and committing to those goals at the day at hand, you're gonna succeed. Don't worry about messing up, it's gonna happen. And also, you should allow yourself some treats. You should allow yourself to go out to dinner. You should allow yourself to eat cake. You should allow yourself to go out drinking with your friends if you want to. Allow yourself the things that you like to do. You don't wanna restrict yourself on anything. Restriction is so bad. Don't restrict yourself. Everything in moderation. And here's my little rule of thumb that I like to go by. 85 to 15. If you eat well and you stick to your goals 85% of the time, 15% of the time you can treat yourself and it won't matter because most of the time you're doing everything right. So if you eat well most of the time, you can allow for that 15% of time that you don't eat well, that you go out, that you have fun, that you indulge. That's healthy, that's good for you. So don't be afraid to do that. And maybe you can even plan that into your program when you write yourself your plan. 85, 15 rule, everything in moderation, no restrictions, okay? No restrictions, this is not a diet, this is not a challenge, this is a lifestyle. This is something that should last you a lifetime. My last point on this is to try new things. Nowadays, there are millions of things you can do to stay healthy, get active, eat well. There are millions of recipes, there are millions of workouts, there are tons of ways you can burn calories, stay healthy and active, and eat well. So if one way doesn't seem to work for you, don't give up, just try a new way. Do your research, find something that's fun for you to do. I've fallen in love with beach volleyball and I think it's an, just a great way to burn calories and to have fun while doing it. Like I was starting to get sick of doing all my cardio in the gym. So I found a new way to do cardio, which is beach volleyball, and it's so much fun, and I just like love it, and I look forward to it every time. I wait for it every week. I'm like, oh, today's volleyball day. You know, get, find something that you're amped about, and then stick to that. Like, you know, so, so try new things. Don't be afraid when something doesn't work for you. You just haven't found the right thing yet. And that goes for, for eating, too. Like, if you absolutely despise broccoli, don't eat broccoli. Find another vegetable that you like, hello, <laughs> you know? Okay, so to wrap that up, you guys, I wanna just touch on my Healthy New You program that I wrote for Oxygen Magazine. It launches this New Year's. We did that strategically because this program I designed to 
be that program that you can do that's gonna last. So the program is, is a 60 day program broken up into three phases. Each phase is supposed to last 20 days, but you can literally live in a phase for as long as you want. The first phase is very slow and progressive. It's very basic. You work out every other day. All the exercises for the entire program you can do at home, minimal equipment. You don't need a gym. You can buy all the equipment at your local store. The first phase is just building a base. That's what I called it, building a base. So you're just going to be doing exercises that are going to build a foundation for you to go to phase two. Phase two is a little bit more intense. It's a little bit more challenging. The workouts get a little bit more advanced, a little more dynamic. You're going to be working out a little bit more times per week and you're going to be sh like starting to burn, sorry, starting to sculpt the muscle that you built in phase one. Phase three is my incinerate phase. So that phase is the most intense, the most cardio inducive, um, the most calories burned. You're going to work out the most times per week. You're still going to have plenty of rest days. Don't worry. Um, and I designed this program. It took me a long time and I put my heart into it because I wanted the program to be for people of all fitness levels. I don't want you to think, oh, this is a beginner's program. It's not. Okay. Like I've done the workouts. I've been working out for seven years now. Oh my gosh, they are challenging and they are as challenging as you want them to be because I give you mod modifications for every single exercise if it's too challenging for you to do it. I give you ch ways to step it up a notch for every single exercise if it's not challenging enough. So the program is going to be exactly whatever you need it to be depending on where your fitness level is and what your goals are. So. What you get with the program, it's an online web-based program. We filmed for this program for a week in Denver, as you guys probably saw the behind the scenes footage. We recorded over 200 videos. So this program is so extensive. You get um, all of my best nutrition tips recorded, delivered to you. You get all of my training philosophy and my workout and healthy lifestyle philosophies delivered to you. You get video explanations for every single exercise. I'll be doing the workouts with you in real time, telling you how to do it exactly from start to finish, what you should be feeling like in your body, what to look out for, what you should not be feeling like, the modifications, the way to challenge yourself, everything you need. You have literally no excuse. This is like the most comprehensive program ever. And it was shot in amazing production quality. So um, you also get grocery lists, a meal plan, um, a step-by-step -step guide to building your own meal plan if you don't like my meal plan. You get over 40 recipes. You get vegetarian recipes for the vegetarians out there. You get so much stuff and it's crazy because you, you also get access to an online Facebook group which I will be actively participating in so we can all support each other and create that sense of community as we do the program together. I'll be there to answer any of your questions and to give you support along the way. The program is yours to keep forever and ever and ever once you purchase it. So um, you can purchase, you don't have to start it before New Year's, that's just when we're launching it. So you can start, you can, you can sign up and start it in July if you want, you know, it's totally up to you. Um, I do have a discount code on the program, it's Katie Saves. That'll save you $15 off the program. So for this entire program, for all the stuff that you get, it's only $83 after my discount, which is absolutely insane, you guys, for the what you get for the money. It's just unbelievable. Like, and I'm so excited and I feel so honored to be able to give you guys such a high quality program. Without oxygen, I would have never been able to do this. So I'm so grateful to them that I've been able to um, write this program and that they put it together in this way to be delivered to you guys like It's gonna be so user focused. I'm so excited um, So more about that is gonna be in the description box as well as a sign up link You can pre sign up for the program the link will be at the end of this video and in the description box below So thank you guys so much for listening and I've been talking my mouth off <laughs> Um, but I will see you in the next video and I hope to see you in the Healthy New You program with Oxygen. I will see you guys later.